Bone Broth Company, or Bone Broths Company. Beef Bone Broth. And this is amazing. One, it's in a container. I could throw it. I could, I could throw it at an old woman. I could, you know, play football with it. Done that. So it's like, four, 41, 16, 40, 47, 1, 1, 2, 365. Oh, sexy butt cheeks. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> play basketball with it. You can only bounce it one time, though, because as soon as you bounce it, it's going to probably break. But what's cool is the packaging. This is uh, one of those, um, I don't know, the Tetra Pak things where it's like, it's sealed air, there's no air getting in. And uh, this thing you can ship everywhere. You can really do amazing stuff with this. And what's great is if you're going on, let's say you're doing a race or if you're doing a workout somewhere or you're traveling somewhere and you need kind of your base nutrition, but you're not gonna spend 24 to 48 hours making bone broth with some human's bones that you had to murder the last night because, well, there were no cows around because you happen to be in a city. But you're probably not a cannibal, you're probably a normal human being, and if you're a normal human being, then you're probably looking for beef broth. So this is a great alternative to actually having to spend 48 hours cooking bones all day long, right? What's in it? Not much. Filtered water, grass-fed beef bones, Onions, organic carrots, organic celery, organic parsley, apple cider vinegar, sea salt, black peppercorn, bay, thyme, and rosemary extract. That's how they make this. The way your mother did, the way your brother did, the way your sister did, and the way your uncle and aunt did. And your crazy, weirdo, second cousin who would always come over with like holes in his pants or his zipper unzipped and it was always hanging out. Yeah, he made the same, he made it the same way. Remember that. And sure, no one ever wanted to drink his because who knows what he did to that. But everybody else in your family made it the right way and they made it this way. It's packable. I can pop this off, squeeze four corners together, tear a long edge, boom. Drink, 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 drink. Power! Throw a little extra collagen in this and you are a beast ready to go. I brought some of this to World Stuff's Mother and I loved it. I loved it. It was great. It worked very, very well. So when it comes to beef bone broth, there's always the issue of cooking it. I don't want, I don't have time to do that. Matter of fact, the last time I had to get bones, so I went out on this land out here somewhere and there was all these cows, I just butchered one out there. And then I had to haul it. it. Took me like 14 hours to get home. It was like middle of the day, I was going down the freeway, just the center of it, just big old cow, drink blood everywhere. That was a lot of work, okay? You don't have to do that kind of stuff. What you wanna do is just buy something like this in a pack, pour it, and be ready to go. Sure, there's other, there's other products out there. But a lot of them are grass-fed. That's important. And as you can see on the picture, the picture even shows them eating grass. 17.6 ounces, this is a good pack. It's great, this makes a good like soup if you need soup. And uh, generally the reason I'm even reviewing this is because it was hard for me to find grass-fed beef bone broth anywhere. I've seen beef bone broth, organic beef bone broth, but not grass-fed. Have it on the shelf. I always keep like four or five of these on the shelf just in case I have to ship them somewhere before race. Bone broth company, beef bone broth, Nine out of 10 because it's impossible to find grass-fed bone broth anywhere. It's an awesome pack. Do anything with it. Like I said, sometimes I shove them in the back of my pocket, back pocket, boom. And then if something happens, anything. Car accident. Gets in flames, I jump out. Jump into the flames. Come out with the whole family on my shoulders. Father, wife, multiple kids, dog, cat, canary. You know, and they're like, some of them are have burn marks and stuff. Half of them are like half bloodied, third degree burn marks or first degree burn marks, whatever. 
just the skin's peeling there. Yeah, and I'm just like, hold on. I pull this out. Look. Yeah, I know I littered, but same time, I kind of need to. And what's nice is in this, I can just pour it on them. Drink some bone broth. They're screaming. The fire's not even pull it fully out, but I'm just pouring bone broth on them. And I'm hoping I get it in their mouth to help them out a little bit. Or, you know, you pick them up and you just hold them, you know, tip them. And you try not to get their, you don't want their, like, their skin since they've been burned, badly burned, touching your shirt or anything. Because it'll pull their skin off and then they'll be in more agonizing pain. So you kind of have to lean them just a little bit. And you just kind of pour it. I don't usually pour because I'm in such a hurry all the time. I just, I rip it. I just dump it and hope it gets in their mouth. If you need to save someone, have one of these on the ready. Homeless guy, need food for family. Do a drive-by bone brothing. Have you ever done that? Probably not. <laughs> you roll down the window, take one, just chuck, I mean, just chuck it at him. Probably knock him out, but when he wakes up, <laughs> he's gonna find it and be just like, yeah! I mean, it's like winning the lottery when you're homeless and you don't have much food. This is when grass fed. You could even say that. Hey, heads up, grass fed! <laughs> Let's say you're in gang territory, right? You're wearing the wrong colors. They surround you. Just pour it on you. And they're going to be like, what the? And it's dumb. Bone bra, they say. Bone bra. And he great. He loco, man. He loco, man. You still loco, aren't you, man? Yeah, it's a bone bra, man. It's a bone bra, huh? Yeah, you you wanna mess with me, huh? You wanna mess with me, huh? They're all gonna walk away. They don't wanna play, they don't wanna fight you. Matter of fact, they're gonna turn a blind eye to the fact that you're wearing purple in their territory. But on another note, don't wear purple anywhere. Check them out. Bone Broth Company. Beef Bone Broth. A winner. Yes. And you don't have to do a wacky thing, you know? Boom. Subscribe down below or up there. I don't know where you subscribe. The best thing to do, close your eyes and just randomly click. You'll, you'll probably get it. Comment, and if you have any questions whatsoever about anything, let me know.